Today, we will report on some mysterious miracle water and how it prevents food poisoning. It is water that has been processed through electrolysis and made into alkaline and acidic water. They are being used in many different ways and the results are surprising. Today is the first of a series and it's about strong disinfectant water and food poisoning. With the rise in temperatures, the most dangerous time for food poisoning is approaching. Hello, now that summer is almost here, we'd like to check the safety of your shellfish and get some samples from you. Market sanitation inspection officers are here at Tsukiji Market in Tokyo to check the sanitary conditions of the fresh shellfish. What's the temperature? It's seven degrees centigrade. Okay, one more sample. A bacterium called Vibrio is one cause of food poisoning. It likes salty water and thrives in shellfish regardless, regardless of its freshness. So these inspector, inspection officers visit the market periodically to take samples of shellfish and to check the sanitary conditions. Food poisoning makes you very sick. There were almost 40,000 cases of food poisoning in Japan in 1990. Food poisoning causes vomiting, diarrhea, exhaustion, high fever, and headache. It is said that once food poisoning occurs, restaurants suffer loss of business for the next 10 years. So they are very careful about it at this time of year. Bacteria called vibrios live in ocean water. They attach themselves to fish and are taken to land in the catch. Uh, these are salmonella. They can be found in the eggs and meat you purchase. Other bacteria that cause food poisoning are staphylococci and colon bacilli. They are also found inside our bodies and can multiply if conditions are right. Uh, the top left of these uh, Petri dishes coming up are uh, salmonella, top right is staphylococci, center is vibrius, bottom left is colon bacilli, and bottom right is serious. If the bacteria that cause food poisoning are hiding in the food, uh, this kind of a party will not be a very fun experience in a couple of hours. However, there is no need to worry anymore. Strong disinfectant water can now prevent food poisoning. This restaurant is Nihon Kaku, located in front of Nakano Station in Tokyo. Uh, the staff here can serve up to 3,600 people, uh, preparing over two tons of food a day, including vegetables, meat, and fish. 100% uh, of the food brought into Nihon Kaku has some kind of bacteria on it. So uh, we have to eliminate the bacteria entirely before we start to prepare the food. There are 16 water faucets set up in the kitchen with very strong disinfectant water. Raw meat, the cutting boards, and everything else is washed with this water. We've been using this strong acidic water for washing for about seven months now. We tried to get rid of these bacteria before, but we were not able to do so completely. Now, as long as we use this disinfectant water, we will be safe. The easiest way to find out whether there's bacteria or not is to culture them in agar. The colored Petri dish contains colon bacilli and the non-colored one another type of bacteria. Uh, we will take a, a sample culture from a woman's hand both before and after washing. Uh, <clears throat> samples were also taken from the cutting boards and meat. Uh, now we're going to look at uh, four Petri dishes 24 hours later. And uh, these will show the results of bacteria culture 24 hours after. A big difference is seen. Left, hands before washing. Right, hands after washing. This is the result of the cutting board surface before and after washing. There's absolutely no bacteria seen anywhere. 
Dr. Matsuo of Miura Electronics is the inventor of the water processing machine. First, tap water comes in this way. In order to electrolyze, electrolyze the water easily, we add some salty water, which makes it conduct electricity better. Then direct current is applied to the water, and that is how electrolysis is done. When you perform electrolysis on water, by adding salt and direct current to it, you can create alkaline water on the negative side and strong acidic water at a pH of 2.7 or lower on the positive side. When bacteria come in touch with the strong acidic water, they die immediately. Another condition that affects bacteria is the water's oxidation reduction potential, or ORP. The remaining chlorine and oxygen in the water also help to eradicate bacteria. In the kitchen at Nihonkaku, no bacteria that causes food poisoning are present anymore. Is it the water that does the disinfecting? I haven't seen the results of the water analysis, so I cannot really say. But let's have a look at the world's first color laser microscope. Uh, you will see salmonella bacteria moving around. Uh, soon we'll put a drop of strong acidic water on the bacteria. The moment the water contacts the salmonella, they die. On the right, you will see before the strong acidic water was added, and on the left, after the acidic water was added. Drinking this water causes no harm at all to the body. It is very mysterious water. Here at Nihonkaku, after the dishes are prepared and ready to serve, the food wagon is covered tightly with plastic wrap to prevent the invasion of bacteria, and it is stored in the refrigerator until serving time. Soon the wedding reception will be in full swing. And we hear the sounds of families and friends clapping as they welcome the newlyweds. To me, it sounds like they are clapping for the disinfectant water that prevents food store, uh, poisoning. Uh, this is amazing. Is this for real? Yes, it's for real. Normally when we talk about water disinfectant, we are talking about chlorine. But if you can disinfect with just water, problems such as stringent odor and harmful side effects will be solved. 